So another conversation that I had over a breakfast meeting with one of my local chief of police is, uh, I said, uh, listen, chief, I'm not sure, <laughs> again, how this is going to hit you. Uh, I said, I am aware that there is a, in our, or in our county, there is a small task force, I think it's two or three individuals, that are uh, police department anti-human trafficking, ta they, they are the police department anti-human trafficking task force, and that they serve as a resource for multiple police departments. I said, I know that that exists, but I don't know what exactly exists in your specific department for this city. And I said, I don't know how much this issue of child trafficking is even on your radar, but it has become a huge issue of concern for us. And we would like to figure out how to partner with you as a police department to address this issue. How can we serve you? We have a, we have a, a church full of, of concerned and full of uh, very capable individuals. We don't want to step on your toes. We don't want to send our church people out to um, you know, break down doors uh, and, and try and <laughs> you know, arrest perpetrators. We want to know from you how we can serve you. How can we come alongside your efforts? And the chief looked at me and he said, you know, Skip, I, I am aware of the, the task force. He said, but to be honest, we have very limited resources and, and we don't have enough information about this for me to even be able to answer your question. He said, from my perspective, you are going to be the, the people that are going to be leading us down this road. And, and I, as the chief of police for this city, want to offer our services to you. How can we serve you as you help our community begin to address this issue?